happy people i'm back with another video and today i'm back with my i believe it's my fourth your nail lab box from a cart my package came in the mail today you guys and i wanted to film this and get it out for you all as soon as possible um i'm excited to see what i got because last month i really enjoyed the box yeah y'all let's hop into it and see what goodies we got this month okay so yes let's see Y'all already know I'm a sucker for this packaging. It says you're in that lab in a box, that beautiful pinky rosy color here. And then let's see what we got. I actually have no idea what's in the box this month. I really geeked, okay? Ooh, okay. Let's see, let's see. Ooh, okay. All right, let me calm down. Okay, so they gave me two of these so that was probably by accident but you know this is just the thank you card and says that you know how the box was curated here's a discount code if you guys want 15 percent off of their website and then you know it just says you're in their lab so let's see what goodies they sent us this month oh my gosh okay let me calm down i see something right here where i'm just like on thrilled about okay so we got here some glitters we got some rhinestones we got some of these little paper decals okay y'all know i'm a sucker for like nail art so let's see what they sent us this month okay oh, this is pretty cool okay. oh these are cute got some rhinestones i'm gonna just take everything out very nice and some stickers okay yeah that's pretty cool so first we got oh wow okay let me take this all the way out here we got two things two sheets of stickers these are kind of like some summer themed stickers like birds and leaves and butterflies and such so that's pretty nice we also got these really beautiful leaves that have like this silver white and black that's really pretty. So I don't have any stickers like this actually. I don't have any like the other one either, but I really like these a lot. So we got some leaf stickers and then we got a ton of different nail art. So y'all, I really actually like these. I haven't had a chance to play around with these yet. I've gotten these from Shein before, but they're just like paper decals. And I think they're just really adorable. I'm gonna take one out here so you guys can get a closer look at it. Essentially, it's just like little cutouts. Let me get this little flamingo here. It's just like a little paper cutout. My nails are kind of busy, so you won't really be able to see it, but yeah, it's just like a cute little paper cutout, right? And this one is of a flamingo, and this is nice because it'll lay really nice and flat on the nail, and then it also has like some really beautiful leaves here, you see? So I have a few of these in my collection, not necessarily these designs, but I have some like this in my collection. I haven't had a chance to play around with them yet, but I'm really excited to play around with them because I feel like they're just gonna be really easy for nail art. So we got some of these. We also got some rhinestones. So we got some multicolored rhinestones, look like some neon, yellow, purple, some iridescent, really cute. Can never have enough bling, okay? So that's nice. We also got these really beautiful leaf um, or feather, not even leaf. I've been saying leaf the whole time. These are feathers, y'all. <laughs> so yeah, these feather uh, charms, which is pretty. I think I actually have these in my collection already. I think I have the gold ones. So, but it's cool to have like the actual stickers to kind of go along with them. We also got some confetti here or some sequins, the, the bigger dots. So that's really pretty. I love these neon colors. We got more of them, but they're in this neon yellow and pink. And then we also have these really beautiful hot pink kind of fuchsia glitter here. We got hearts, hexagons, stars, just a lot of different um, things in it. It's really, really pretty, as well as some fine glitter, as you, as you can see at the bottom here. So these are really, really pretty. I like these a lot. Let's see what's next here. We have a uh, red gel polish. It's in the color Scarlet. So let's take a look at that. Ooh, that is like red, red. Okay, yeah, that's pretty. That's a nice, like, pure like apple red almost that's really pretty we also got maureen this is really beautiful purple color you know that's that's interesting i actually have a a friend her name is maureen i haven't talked to her in a while we were friends in high school um that just made me think of her but yeah um really beautiful uh purple gel polisher Ooh, it's like a nice uh pastel almost leaning lavenderish really really pretty i like that a lot Okay, so we have that. We also have, let's see what this is. Oh, a base coat, cool. 
I actually don't have um, McCart's base coat, so that's pretty nice. And you get a 15 ml bottle, so you get a lot of it, okay? And so that's what the consistency looks like. Let's see. It's a medium viscosity. It's not too thick, not too thin. Yeah, very nice. I'll be excited to play around with their base coat and see how I like it. Um, and then you all know I also do um, dip powder with the gel method, so I can never have enough base coat, you know what I mean? So yeah, that's nice. I got McCart's base coat here. We also get, what is this? Nail surface cleanser. Okay, a two-in-one formula. That's different. It's a nail surface cleanser. Nail surface cleanser. Okay, I guess this is kind of like alcohol or something. I'm guessing you can use this to clean off the surface of your nails if you have like a sticky layer, um, which is good for like poly gel and um, top coats that have the inhibition layer. I'm thinking you might also be able to use this as a slip solution too. So, okay, that's pretty nice. And this is a 1.76 fluid ounce bottle, so 50 ml. That's different, okay. Then you also get, oh cool. Okay, looks like we got two poly gels here, which is really nice. We got glow yellow and top notch, okay? So let's go ahead and open these up. Okay, so this is a 30 ml, so that's 1.0, 1.06 fluid ounces, and it looks like it's a, a gold poly gel. Let's see. Ooh, I was wrong, it's not gold. What is this? Do y'all see this color? Wow. It's like this hollow iridescent awesomeness. Oh my God, I cannot wait to swatch this. So I'm gonna be swatching this for you all here shortly. That is really pretty. So that's what, it kind of looks like a, like a galaxy type color. That's really pretty. Okay, so we got top notch. That was not what I was expecting to come out of this bottle, okay? And then we also have um, glow yellow. And I'm excited about this because y'all know yellow. Yellow is my favorite color, okay? So I'm excited. I'm excited to have a yellow poly gel. I think this is actually gonna be, yeah. I think this is actually gonna be my first yellow poly gel. I don't actually have any own any yellow poly gel, so I'm excited about this. But this, I'm assuming, is a glow in the dark color. So I'm super thrilled to have this. Y'all know I love some glow as well. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, that's really pretty. Oh, I like this a lot. Okay, y'all, I can't wait. Okay, so we're gonna do some swatching of this as well. And we're gonna definitely see if it glows, but it's also a 30 ml poly gel. What else we got here, y'all? Then we also have a nail liner in rose gold. Ooh, okay. This is so cool. Such a nice variety of items in here, okay? So y'all know whenever I have any type of potted gels here, I like to use this cuticle pusher to open them up just so that it's less messy. So I just kind of come along the side and open it just like this. And I normally just do halfway. Wow. That's pretty. Holy moly. Okay. That's really pretty. So yeah, I'll be excited to play around with this as well. I'll do some swatching of this also. So all right y'all, looks like we got a nice little variety of items here. That's everything that came in this month's box. I'm gonna go ahead and get my swatch sticks ready and uh, we gonna get the swatching, okay? First I wanna go in and swatch the uh, purple poly gel in the color Moraine. I'm gonna swatch it on the inside so I don't have to worry about top coating. Yeah, that looks nice and pigmented, really pretty. I'm just gonna do the one coat on camera and I'll do the second coat off camera. That's really pretty. The next I'm gonna go in with this really beautiful scarlet color. I mean, this is a really pretty red. Yeah, that's nice, really pretty. That's like red, red. And so whenever I go in to swatch uh, poly gels, I normally go in with a layer of base coat inside of my swatch sticks because um, I notice that when I don't use the layer of base coat um, that the poly gel tends to pop off. And so since the box came with a base coat, I'm gonna go ahead and prep these two um, swatch sticks with the base coat so that I can swatch the poly gels. 
now I'm gonna go in and, and swatch the two poly gels that came in the kit. Um, I'm excited for both of these colors, but I really wanna see what this like hollow glitter situation, unicorn awesomeness was looking like. Cause that's such a unique color. Just gonna apply a little bit of it to the inside of the swatch stick. Yeah, that's such a different color. It's like a disco ball, you know? So I got my alcohol here and I'm just gonna go ahead and move that poly gel to where I want it to be. Yeah, that's such a unique color that they put in here. I like that. It's different. Very, very different. That's just, it just gives me galaxy vibes, you know? Such a cool color. I don't think I've seen any poly gel like this before. Any poly gel. So I'm gonna cure that for 60. And then my bay, you know, yellow. Let's see what we got here. I love the fact that it glows in the dark. This much here. Beautiful. Yeah, that's pretty. And that's the yellow. And that's a really pretty yellow. It's kind of like a lemon yellow. Ooh, I can already see the glow. Wow. I'm getting ready to swatch this uh, rose gold liner. I just want to show you all the consistency of this product. I'm not really sure if maybe this is like a spider gel or something, but it's like really sticky. Like when you pick up a little bit of it, like a lot of it comes out. So I'm not really sure why that is. Is, is it supposed to be like this? Like. Again, it's giving me spider gel vibes, and I'm not sure if that's what it actually is. But yeah, I just wanted to just wanted to show you all that. Okay. Yeah, it's like I, it got to be a spider gel, huh? Yeah, I don't know. It says it just says liner though. Nail liner. Okay. All right. Well, yeah, just wanted to show you all that. Just wanted to show you all that. Let's see if I can get this <laughs> swatch in a swatch stick. <laughs> it's so sticky. I think this is spider gel, you guys. Y'all tell me, is this spider gel? I think it's spider gel. Am I supposed to do it like this? Yeah, I think this is spider gel. I'm like 90% sure this is spider gel. And if this is spider gel, that's pretty cool because this is like my first one. Right, is that, I think this is how this is supposed to be used. Like something like this. I don't know what's happening, but. I think this is how, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is spider gel. So yeah, that's just a quick little design there that was impromptu and I'm gonna go ahead and cure that, okay? Yeah, that's different. That's pretty cool. That is sticky though. First color here that came is the Maureen. So that's this really pretty kind of purple, almost like a lilac kind of uh, color. Really, really pretty. So that's what that looks like. The next color that came in this month's box is Scarlet, which is this absolutely stunning red. It's like a nice dark apple red. Like it's a really true, a really beautiful true red, like a classic red. Really like that a lot. Next color we have here is Top Notch, and this is a top notch color, okay? It's a really beautiful, I don't even know how to describe this color, but it's absolutely stunning. It's like a hollow that has like this pink, purple, um, gold-ish shift to it. It's like really stunning. I mean, it, the color can speak for itself. I don't even know if the camera is really picking up how beautiful and how much depth it is to this, but it's really gorgeous. Here is this uh, glow yellow. So it's like a glow in the dark yellow. So it kind of looks like a jelly yellow color to me. And I want to show you all how it glows. So let's see the glow on it. So this is what the glow looks like on this yellow color. It's really, really beautiful. It's a nice glow. But I will say, I don't feel like the glow lasts that long. You see, as I'm talking, how the glow is already starting to dim. Um, I've had other poly gels and or dip powders that had a glow that lasted a lot longer. Um, so yeah, but the glow is still beautiful and still stunning. So that is the yellow glow. And then the last color we have here is this rose gold nail liner. And I believe this is a spider gel, you guys. It doesn't say it here on the container, but I'm like 95% sure it's a spider gel because 
this stuff was sticky, okay? <laughs> this was actually my first time working with spider gel, so I actually had no idea what I was doing, but I think that this rose gold col color is really pretty. I feel like this will look good over like a white or even a black polish, so I'm excited to play around with this. This is everything that came in this month's Your Nail Lab box. I'm very satisfied with this month's box. I do feel like it came with a variety of different colors and different items. It came with the nail surface cleanser, two poly gels, which retail for typically 15 bucks alone. It came with two gel polishes, six little um, containers of nail art, a full size 15 ml base coat, and then two things of stickers, and even a spider gel, you guys. So I'm very happy with like the variety and even the uniqueness of the colors that were included, especially this top notch uh, gel polish. And I love that a glow poly gel was included. So yeah, overall, as y'all can see, I'm very happy with this box. We got charms, we got rhinestones, we got confetti, we got glitter. So very, very happy. Um, I would like to see though, hopefully in a future box coming soon, um, for them to include maybe some dip powders. Um, I've been wanting to try out their dippies and or maybe um, more acrylics because y'all know I'm kind of getting into that. But yeah, I'm very satisfied with this month's box. Love the variety. Love everything that was included. Unfortunately, y'all, I, I feel bad. I feel like every month I never have time to actually do a look with everything that came in the box. But um, just like you all saw me do throughout the month last month, I will try to incorporate all of these items into some of the sets that I do. It won't be like a dedicated set to this particular box, but you all will see me get full use out of all the products that have came in my Your Nail Out box. So let me know what you guys think. Did you like this month's box? Um, what do you think about the items that were included? And are you all planning on getting it? Okay. If you all are curious about the set that I have on, these are some press on nails that I am testing out. And so a full review for them will be linked in the description box below. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Thursdays in particular are my Nail Therapy Thursday premieres where I tune in live with you all as you watch me do my nails. And if you like what you saw here, definitely stick around, join the happy family. I'd love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye!